With the announcement of Crucible tokens going away in the recent TWAB, I decided to hand in all of my tokens. And these are the interesting bits from the results I got. Starting off, number one, the armor. For some reason, the armor drop rates were way more higher than any of the weapons in the game. And about 80% of the total drops I got were, you guessed it, just armor. But the sad thing is that I did not keep a single one of them because either the stats were just abysmal or they just weren't what I want them to be. But bottom line is most of them were just trash. Secondly, the weapons. The weapon drops I got still give me nightmares because I kept getting the same drop over and over again and I will show you the weapon on screen but I will give you 5 seconds to guess what weapon this is. You can pause this video and type in the comments down below what you think this is. The 7th Seraph LMG was the highest dropped weapon, right next to the Whispering Slab. However, the most dropped weapon types were auto rifles, bows, swords, SMGs, and LMGs, while the lowest were sidearms, scout rifles, pulse rifles, rocket launchers, snipers, heavy GL, hand cannons, and shotguns. Number third, the enhancement cores. I got about 120 enhancement cores. Now I'm only counting the cores I got from tokens and not from dismantling the drops, which then would amount to a higher number of 180 enhancement cores. Now I decided to keep this video short and simple. I hope this video has helped you get an idea of what you're getting, but still I found these results very interesting, so I decided to make a video on it. I hope this video has helped you guys, I really do, and if it has, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more Destiny 2 related content, and I'll see you guys in the next video.